For Steve Long, a $25,000 long distance bill from TELUS is a far cry from music to his ears. Why do they have the right to, to make us go through, you know, we've got a business to run. We've got the president of Long McQuaid, which runs 50 musical instrument stores across Canada, has been battling the phone company for 18 months, refusing to pay long distance charges he said his company didn't make, which originally added up to $83,000. 18 months later, we're still trying to sort, sort it out. Uh, During a weekend in June 2009, over 25 consecutive phone calls, each lasting at least a half hour, were made from Long and McQuaid's head office in Pickering to a pay-per-use service in Germany. They say it, somebody phones into our system and then hacks through our voicemail and phones out, but you can't do that with our system. Hmm. So we're saying, well, I don't think that's what happened. Um, I, you know, there's a lot of things that could happen. There. TELUS examined Long and McQuaid's case and came to the conclusion that while it is fraud, they pointed out because it's not their equipment that was compromised, TELUS isn't responsible. We would never put our customers through this. Um, I mean, I guess we probably won't be a customer that much longer. And if nothing gets accomplished soon, though, Long will consider legal action. For Toronto Sun, I'm Jenny Ewan.